What's up everyone, it's the Razor Edge, and today I'm here to bring you guys some Gears 5 news. So as I'm sure most of you have seen by now, there was a trailer that was released on Dave Bautista's official Twitter account that says that he is officially going to become a playable character within Gears 5. Now this kind of comes off of the momentum he's having when it comes to his push to play the role of Marcus Phoenix in the Gears of War movie, and so this is kind of like... The Coalition and Microsoft kind of giving a nod to, you know, his support for the franchise and, uh, you know, how much he's been advocating for the role and the community support uh, for his uh, push for the role as well. He was, he was fan cast as uh, Marcus Phoenix back in the day, long before he became uh, an actor. And be, mainly because he looked just like Marcus Phoenix, especially when he was rocking the soul patch on his on his chin back in uh, back in the Evolution days. If you guys watch wrestling, if you know what that is. But for anyone who doesn't, uh, sorry. <laughs> but anyway, moving on to the actual news itself here. So some uh, the news came out with the with the live action trailer of him wearing the armor, and he put out his tweet. But then Xbox Wire came out with an article talking about uh, you know some more details about everything that's going on and also release some in-game like screenshots of gameplay of what the character looks like in game so uh it starts off here so it says batista coming to gears 5 it's about time the superstar declares today wwe superstar batista confirmed the long-standing hopes of many including his own as revealed on his personal Twitter account, Batista will officially enter the Gears of War universe later this month, donning the armor of Marcus Phoenix as a Gears 5 multiplayer character. Now you may notice in the in the live action trailer, it looks like he's wearing like some kind of version of JD's armor. That's obviously the, uh, some kind of marketing armor that they had made up in it, like they just threw it on him and it fit him perfectly. Um, but notice that this is a cross promotion between Dave Microsoft and uh, the Coalition and World Wrestling Entertainment. Now, what's interesting about that is if it's like that, that means that it's quite likely that when they were discussing this crossover that if they wanted to do like executions and emotes uh, like uh, or expressions they're called in uh, Gears 5 that you know people would want stuff like the Batista bomb or his uh, or his thumbs down or his you know all that kind of stuff or give me what I want or I quit like some of his famous quotes from WWE those would be things that people would want so in order for them to do that they would have to approach WWE and to use the name Batista bomb since WWE more than likely owned the name B, uh, Batista, B-A-T-I-S-T-A. Notice that it's actually different spelling from his actual name, B-A-U-T-I-S-T-A. Because what, this is probably too much in depth for you guys, but I, I'm passionate about wrestling and Gears of War, so why not? Um, so basically, if, if a wrestler, like, comes into the WWE, they're given a name by WWE, so the WWE own that name. So that means that if the if the performer leaves the company, that the name and like kind of all their move sets and stuff kind of or the names at least uh, stay within WWE. So WWE owns the character of Batista, sort of. But Dave Batista is his own person as well. So it's kind of like a, a cross promotion between uh, all three of uh, of these entities, you could say. So it says uh, fans around the world have long expressed hope that Batista will be cast for the role of Marcus Phoenix in the film version of Gears of War, an opportunity he's described as a dream role. Uh, while the movie remains in development, the Coalition didn't want any more time to go by without giving Batista a chance to don the armor, which he wore as part of an upcoming WWE Network promotion for Gears 5. According to those who were there, the armor which was created to match specifications of the game fit him perfectly. Rod Ferguson, who has cast and directed every Gears title, directed Batista's performance for Gears 5, including over 700 lines recorded for the game. So. He's definitely got expressions in there which are like, you know, voice lines that he can say. So I'm curious to see if he's, he's got some WWE stuff in there, more than likely since it's a WWE promotion. But maybe he's got some stuff from his character from the MCU, Drax the Destroyer. Maybe he's, there's some invisible standing still jokes in there, stuff like that, you know what I mean? Or, you know, you should fight each other for the honor of leadership or just any, any Drax quotes you can think of. Maybe there's something in there. 
uh, which is cool. Maybe some Batista memes in there as well. But it says, adding Batista to Gears 5, we started with the fantasy of Batista as Marcus, putting Batista in Marcus's armor and starting with Marcus's script. Then we added elements of the animal Batista into his voice performance and onto his look by adding his signature Hollywood shades to his character. Batista was great in the booth and I can't wait for Gears and Batista fans alike to stomp the swarm as the animal. Xbox has partnered together with WWE to create a special countdown to Batista's availability to the game, including behind the scenes with Gears 5 and Batista on WWE's Up Up Down Down Gaming channel. This all leads up to the WWE Network's Class of Champions, or Clash of Champions, sorry, event on Sunday, September 15th, available through a free subscription on the Xbox app new subscribers only. And now the piece of information I'm sure a lot of you guys are looking for. To unlock Batista, simply play any version of Gears 5, including with your Xbox Game Pass membership, beginning September the 15th, and the promotion ends October 28th. So basically, if you play Gears 5 at all between September the 15th and October the 28th, you will unlock Batista in Gears 5. Gears 5 launches on Xbox One and Windows 10 PC on September the 6th for Xbox Game Pass Ultimate members, September 10th for Xbox Game Pass members. Gears 5 is also available for pre-order today from the Microsoft Store, and there'll be more details in the description if you guys are interested. But how insane is this, guys? We've A lot of us have fancast Batista as Marcus Phoenix for years, and since he's kind of... Uh, come out more publicly in the last year or so, you know, really pushing for the role as Marcus Phoenix in Gears 5. It's incredible to see the amount of support he's getting, and now the coalition of Microsoft are kind of bringing him into the fold and including him uh, in the game, which is amazing to see. I remember when he asked for, uh, when he was when he was reaching out to, you know, fans of his and, and, and all of like the, the Gears the Gears community was like, you know, if anyone wants to start a petition uh, to help me out, and I, I, I'll be honest, I jumped, right at, I jumped right at the opportunity to do that. I actually created a petition that IGN then wrote about, and uh, I've been like super behind the idea of him playing Marcus Phoenix uh, like for years now, since back in the days, like since back in 2007, honestly, like it was, it's been going on that long, it's ridiculous. And he only, as he ages, he kind of fits into the role even more. But uh, yeah, I could talk about this kind of stuff for ages guys but that is it that's how to unlock batista and here there was a bunch of screenshots obviously rolling through the video for you guys to take a look at the character and all that so super easy to unlock him and uh yeah all this kind of stuff is only going to help the game guys and i can't wait uh, to see what else is in store for gears in the future but if you guys enjoyed the video be sure to drop a like subscribe to my channel for all future gears 5 related content share the video around if you really enjoyed it follow me on twitter at the razor edge if you guys are subscribing, make sure to turn notifications on to be notified of all my videos as soon as they go live. Discord link in the description, and I will see you guys next time. Hey guys, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to drop a like, leave a comment down below letting me know what you thought. Subscribe to my channel if you're brand new for more videos. Share the video around if you really enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time.